Hello and welcome, this is Al from my Open Source channel and uh, welcome again to a new episode. Today I'm going to um, have a look some of the comments that I had from one of my videos on how to install Mobirise and getting started. Um, now it's going to be a little bit difficult here to uh, to read these names she Shilfari and Prophet she asked how to add your logo and I'm going to show you now as well although I most of them I actually replied um, anyway another one I think was Monte Ashberg asked I'll do it again I replied it how to publish it directly to the web server and i'm going to show you as well how i'm going to do that and, and that's it i think with this one here but anyway i would like to thank to all my subscribers at the moment we are at 1452 and hopefully rising don't forget to like dislike if you don't like it and share my videos. The more you share and like it, the more videos I can do. Now I set up uh, a tutorial.ddns using no IP directly to my Raspberry Pi. I'm uh, I'm running Raspberry Pi. I'm also running uh, a copy of uh, Centora where I already set up the FTP server on it so I can actually show you how to publish directly to the server all right without any delay I'm going to minimize my browser here we go already using FileZilla to log into the server and um, if we go back here we go here you can see this is where it is, old index, and that's the old index. The reason why, let's see if I can uh, do this, but this is what you're going to look after. But anyway, let's do this for now, and let's go to Mobilize. I got the version 2.9.8, and this is the actual page comes with it the actual uh, first page that's where you start it now to change the logo all you need to do is just click on the logo there we go then click on change image now i got a demo logo here all i need to do is click on it open and there we go has been changed all you need to do now is press ok now i'm going back just in case you want a link to the home page you can do this way and you can also have the top if you want to but the easy way is that index and make sure it's not open in the new window then press ok now if you remember uh mobilize is very simple to use all you need to do is drag and drop as you can see all the elements you can uh, drag and drop maps if you want to subscribe and also contact pages let's let's put this one here here we go now let's say for example you're happy with the design there are different ways you can do it now if I go to let me see here oh, let me do this one here first now if I'm going to create a folder on my desktop and I'm going to call it site demo so the first option is to publish to the local folder so I'm going to click on browse site demo 
on my desktop. I'm going to select the folder and I'm going to click publish. Now I'm going to close this one here and as you can see now inside the folder we have the project file and the rest the index and the assets folder. Now I'm going to open my file zilla and all I need to do is upload to your server by the FTP as I have done here. Now when I'm going back to the browser as you can see this is the newer version with the new logo now here I forgot to remove Mobilize, but if I go to Mobilize and I click on the top here and I'm going to remove show brand name, that will disappear and all I'm going to do is press uh, publish and I'll republish again. Now, of course what I need to do now if I close this one here and I'm going to open the this is the new ones so what you need to do is to be honest what you need to do if I go to desktop again site demo is just replace the index now when I refresh the page you will see the mobilize on top here has disappeared now this was the first way of doing it by uh, publishing locally and then upload to the server now I'm going to show you the next step is how to publish it directly to the server now we're going to disconnect this one here of course this is locally here but uh, you can do it as you wish I'm going to press edit I'm going to click on the host and I'm going to type the IP 192.168.1.105 the username in this case Z admin to Tutorials. Of course, this for me will change all the time, so that's why I can show you exactly the username. And I'm going to close that. And as you can see here, the FTP is done. What I'm going to do now is just press uh, publish. But before I do this, see if I can go to. To the browser and as you can see I got 403 access forbidden because there's nothing there go back to the publish of mobilize and I'm going to click publish and now it's exporting everything to the server automatically now if I go to the browser again and I refresh it I should see again the website with all information there there we go. Now if I log back again with FileZilla and I press F5 again, I think. Yep, let's refresh this. As you can see, in this case, it actually uh, uploaded the project as well. That's the option you get when you publish directly to the server. When you do it locally, you don't have to do that. So you just put index in the asset folder. And we go, we delete this one here. And I'm going back to the Mobilize. Click again on Publish. Now here, you can, what you can do, you can actually upload to a folder. You can create, say, a website. And here you choose your Google Drive right now I don't use Google Drive so unfortunately I'm um, I will be I, I won't be able to show you how I do it but it's quite easy 
just uh, if we install Google Drive with your system, that will automatically appear. Just click it and select it and then press publish. That will be as simple as that. Now, see if I can actually got. Um, I got one drive, but I, not, I don't think I installed Google Drive here. So, no, unfortunately, I cannot do that. So, anyway. I would like to thanks again to all my subscribers and not as well, of course. And don't forget to share and like my videos. And uh, I'll see you next time for another tutorial. Thanks again for joining me and I'll see you next time.